Hi, this is Reading Rocks 88 and I'm going to be presenting a math video today. It's going to be about base numbers and how to convert them. So, first of all, let's start with we um are in base 10. So, if you wrote the number 15, 15 means 5 ones and 1 10, correct? But it can also be written as 5 times 10 to the 0th plus 1 times 10 to the 1st, which adds up to 15. So assume you took the number, uh, let's say, 63 in base 10, and you wanted it to, to convert it to base four for example so if you want to convert from um base 10 to base four so if you want to convert to base 10 to base n what you do is you take the number you want to convert you take the number 63 and then you start dividing it by the by the base n that you want to convert it to so 63 divided by 4 is 15 with Remainder 3. Make sure you have the remainders on the sides. Divide that by 4 again. You get um, 3. Remainder 3. Divide that by 4 again. And then you get 0. Remainder 3. Now you keep on dividing this number until you get 0 as a quotient. And then you look at the remainders. And then you read them from up to down. So the remainders are 3, 3, and 3. So 63 in base 10, a 63 in base 10 is equivalent to 333 in base 4. I didn't mean for that coincidence to happen, it just happened. So, if we wanted to convert base n to base 10, it's actually sort of easier. So let's take the number 336 in base 3 for example then you want to transfer it to base 10 so all you have to do is do 6 times 3 to the 0 plus 3 times 3 to the 1st plus 3 times 3 squared because just like base 10 where we made it like this we're going to do this in base 3 so this equals 6 plus 9 plus um, 27, which equals 42. And 336 in base 3 is equivalent to 42 in base 10. So a question that comes up sometimes is how do I convert base, for example, base 6 to base 2? Well, all you have to do is convert base 6 to base 10 in the way I showed you, and then convert from base 10 to base 2. It's actually pretty easy that way. So, I hope you learned something today from this video, and see you next time with another math video. And just so you know, in base n, there are only a certain number of digits like in base 10 we have 0 to 9 because that's 10 digits and then in like base 6 we only have 0 to 5 because that's 6 digits and if you're converting from base 10 to say base 4 then you would only you would only have the numbers 0 1 2 and 3 so in your in your answer in base 4 if it had like a wacky number wacky digit 8 then you must have divided wrong so thanks for watching